Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. I am Lime Green. As by the title, you already know we are here for a wig review. This is the Zuri Sis. This is the Zuri Sis Natural Star. I have it in the natural pressed texture. The style that I have is Nat Lace H Rami, R-O-M-Y, and I have it in the color natural. This is the stock card. It says, texture and soft so it's textured and soft it comes with care constructions in the back it is heat safe up to 400 it is hand tied and this is a lace front so i have her right here i'm gonna go ahead and place her on my head and we're gonna jump right into this video but first if you are new to this channel and you like what you see, subscribe. And also, if you are a returning subscriber, I really, really appreciate it, you guys. All right, so I have her on my head. This is how she's looking. It's a normal lace front hairline. I don't see any baby hairs, but of course, you can make your own. It does have like a little puffiness at the top, but I do not feel no filler head. So that is a great pro right there. So this is how she's looking. The texture on this is soft. It is soft. I really like this. I just tried the Janet Natural Light and this one is softer. This is nice. So I'm gonna go ahead, cut off the lace and I'll be right back. so I am done with the styling on her this is definitely a nice looking press texture wig the texture feel really nice on her it's really cute it just ages me a bit but yeah overall it just depends on your preference it does I'm sorry I'm looking at my mirror right here but yeah I'm this right here this part right here I don't like all that but a preference but it looks really like a pressed natural texture wig and so i can't complain about that it feels really soft and then the color is looks damn near like my hair color so i'm glad that i got a natural instead of a 1b and this is the text this is not the texture this is the lace that i cut off the lace is like on the brown side so i'm very happy about that I did not have to add, add powder if I wanted. Well, no, this color, this powder matte matches my skin tone. So I like how it was easy to, you know, camouflage. But I do like this wig. It just ages me a bit. So that's the only thing. But, but anywho, let's jump into the specs and details on this wig to see if you guys want to spin your coin or not. So the luster on this wig mm. and the light the luster it's like a natural luster there's no shine to it and there's no dryness to it it feels really soft to me so when i touch this i don't feel like i'm touching dried brittle hair like some of these natural wigs this feels very soft and natural it reminds me of the the Nisha's wig. I don't want to say the Julian wig by Altre. That one is very soft and beautiful and voluptuous. And that one is more yakky. This one is more natural. So yeah. The density on this wig, it looks really full. I have all the hair pulled to the front. So as you can see, it's really full, but yet it's very lightweight. The texture is obviously a natural texture. It is yakky, but it has a nice natural light texture. It's not heavy or any of that. Um, shedding. I did not get any shedding with this wig. And I don't have any tangling with this wig at the moment. And let's see what this hair. What, this hair is heat safe up to 400 degrees. The um this is how the parting space is looking if you want you can add baby hairs it will look probably more natural but to me this still looks natural like this could be my hair 
And I'm going to turn around and give you guys a 360. This is the front. Hopefully my camera don't fall. <laughs> Side. And let me know how the back is looking. And that is the back. Hopefully I got it looking right. And as you can see, I did add some heat at the top part. Let me test this first because you don't want it getting too hot. Now, I try not to go down as much because as you can see, it's going to make it come straight. So just be cautious with that. You don't want the textures to not look mismatched. So just be very light with the hot comb because you will change the texture of it. So overall, my opinion, so my preference, this is not really the wig for me. It's too, to me, it, it matures me a bit and it's a bit puffy. So it's not my preference, but overall, this is a great wig for anybody who loves a natural looking, blown out, pressed wig. You will absolutely love this wig. This wig looks really good. It looks really like your hair. This, I really like it but it's not my preference. But I just wanna let you guys know if you was to buy this and you love natural pressed hair and all that, you won't be disappointed at all. So that is all that I have on this wig. I don't wanna repeat anything. It seems like I'm rambling. I hate when I do that. So if you have any questions that you feel that I did not answer, please leave it in the description box and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, this is the Zuri Sis. This is the natural star and she is a banger for all you natural girls who likes natural pressed wigs. So thank you so much for watching and I love you guys. Bye.